Hey, hey, it's officially tax season. If you had any subs that you gave a 1099 to, you must fill out this form, a 1096. I'm going to show you how. In this first section, you're going to put your name or your business name, whichever you use to pay your subs. Then you're going to put in a complete address. That is a uh, street address, city, state, and zip code. The next section is asking for a person they can contact if they need to. So put a name there and put a phone number in that next box. The next thing is you're going to put in your email address as well as a fax number. If you don't have a fax number, don't trip about it. Just leave it blank. It's quite all right. They just need to be able to reach you in the event they need to. The next section here is asking for an EIN or your social. This number needs to match whatever is on your business tax return. Whether you're using your social security number or your EIN is what you will put here. The next thing is you're going to put in the total number of forms that you are sending in. Remember, you need a 1099 copy with this form for each person you gave one to. The next is federal withhold. And then that last box is asking how much does all of the 1099s total income add up to? In this section here, you're going to pick only one box. You can only use one of these forms per type of form in these boxes. So if it's uh, 1099 NEC and you need to use something else, you're going to have to fill out another form. Make sure you sign, put your title and date. That's it.